Hey everyone, this is Andrew Tai. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to show you how to pair a Bluetooth controller with Ryu Jinx on a Mac. So if you didn't already know, Ryu Jinx is a switch emulator which works fantastically on Apple Silicon hardware. However, you're going to need a Bluetooth controller of some kind. Today I'm going to show you how to pair the Sony DualSense controller, which is the PS5 controller. You don't necessarily need switch Joy-Cons in order to get this to work. So I'm going to go through the whole process of pairing and also getting it working with Ryu Jinx on a Mac. So if you haven't subscribed already, then please consider subscribing and you'll be able to keep up to date with the latest Mac gaming tutorials. So what we're going to do is to go to the Bluetooth menu first. So we're going to click the top left hand side of the screen and then go to system settings. And then within the Bluetooth menu on the left sidebar, this is the new location of the Bluetooth menu. This shows all of the currently paired Bluetooth devices. So there are none at the moment. It also shows Bluetooth devices that are ready to be paired. So on our DualSense controller, what we're going to do is to hold down the share button and then we're going to hold down the PlayStation Home button. I want to wait for this to start flashing. And as soon as that starts going to pairing mode, you'll see it on the macOS screen here. So here I'm going to press the connect button and you'll know it's connected once this goes into a solid light. The next thing I'm going to do is to pair this to Ryu Jinx on macOS. So if you haven't installed Ryu Jinx already, then make sure to follow the link in the description for my video tutorial on how to do so. So once we have Ryu Jinx up and running, what we need to do is to go to the menu bar. And so within options here, what we're going to do is go to settings and then we're going to go to input. And what we're going to do is to select my PlayStation 5 controller, which I've already paired up. And then I'm going to press apply. And now the PS5 controller is all set up as a Joy-Con pair. And you can now go ahead and use this within Switch Emulation on a Mac. Anyway, I hope you found this video useful. If you did, please like, please subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.